Hey, Adam here from Aerial Motion Photography and in this video I'm going to demonstrate how to link up a controller and a drone that aren't synced. If that sounds interesting, watch these steps and we'll get right into it. There might be a couple of reasons why you need to link a remote and a drone together. For me personally, it's because my drone broke, I sent it into DJI and they replaced it with a new one and I still have my original remote. So I need to get this linked up to my new drone. Another reason might be if you lost your remote and now you're replacing it with a new one or if you're doing just a complete reset, deleting the app and then um, trying to boot everything back up again, this will be helpful for you too. The first thing we need to do is to turn on the drone and the controller. So we'll do that by pressing down on the power and holding it like that. Same with the drone, press down once and then hold it down like that. Once you have them turned on, launch the app. That's gonna load and then it says aircraft disconnected. That's because these aren't synced together yet. Our next step is to click these three dots in the top right hand corner that will bring us into general settings. We're going to click on the controller icon and we're going to scroll down to linking remote controller. We're going to press OK. When it starts beeping, that's how you know it's going to start connecting. It says binding right here. Let's lay the drone on its back and we're going to push this button right here to link it hold it down and then now it says controller linked. The next step is to click this restart now button that will restart the aircraft and it says it will complete the activation. And just like that, Mavic 2 successfully activated. And there you go, remote controller linked. And now we need to calibrate the compass. So we'll click on that, where it says compass, error, we're going to choose calibrate. It says, do you want to start? We're going to click start. Now we need to follow these directions. So we hold the drone and it looks like we're turning it counterclockwise. And then we're going to rotate the drone like this. And that concludes this video on how to sync your controller with your drone. If you found this video entertaining or educational, give it a big thumbs up. That means a lot to me. The more views and the likes each video gets, it puts these videos in front of more and more people and helps the channel grow. If you like this video and you like these tutorials, subscribe down below and check the bell notifications so you'll be notified when I upload my newest videos. My name's Adam. As always, fly safe, take care, peace.